The most access hits the air Friday night. There are a lot of stars. The most access dot com got you covered. Get the most access Friday at 1130 on CW 69. Yo, what's good? It's your girl, Miss Shanika from Hot 1079. And, you know, I hooked up with the most access, and I'm going to be doing a segment every week called Miss Shanika's Weekly Rant, giving you all the hottest entertainment news stories and some that you might not think that are so hot, but it's all good because we're going to give it to you anyway. We're going to go ahead and jump into the first story. Now, this story is about Jay-Z. Jay-Z and uh, Governor Patterson from New York City are under investigation. That's federal investigation. Now, uh, <laughs> basically, they have a friendship, a bond or whatever that is raising some eyebrows. They're saying that Jay-Z is a part of AEG, and uh, pretty much that's like an entertainment company that picked up the racetrack slash casino. You know, that's going to be a big look for New York City. Now, Jay-Z owns seven percent stake in the company and they're saying that his relationship with governor patterson basically influenced the whole deal now according to the law that is against the law because they're saying that jay-z did some under the table kind of things i really think it sounds like profiling because the good old boys have been doing this for so long you know i really don't know where it makes sense at but anywho russell simmons chimed in and said that uh if they both you know conspired in a deal like this they are doing a disservice to the citizens of new york city so, Russell sounds like he's hating a little bit, but it's all good. <laughs> Gotta move on, my girl Keisha Cole. It was said this week that she had her baby. Now, her sister Elite was being a little attention whore and just wanted to be doing too much and got on Twitter and said, you know, congrats, KC, you're a mommy now. And, you know, she got some heat from some of Keisha Cole's fans and uh, she went back and forth with some. Anyway, Keisha Cole has not had her baby yet. She's still eight months pregnant. And uh, as we all know, she's having a baby boy by Daniel Gibson, you know, her boyfriend slash husband. I don't know because she ain't really telling nobody her business. <laughs> I guess we'll all know when Keisha Cole is ready, but as of right now, she is still preggers. Now, some sad news. I got to talk about my girl, Whitney Houston. Whitney performed in Australia over, I think it was last week. I don't know, but I seen the footage and it was not a good look. As you can take a look for yourself, she was not hot enough. She sounded like a dog in heat, and I just really couldn't believe, you know, my ears. Sounds like she maybe needs to go back and get some practice on those windpipes. I don't, I don't really know what's going on, but the people that showed up to the concert in Australia, you know, Australians are pretty happy-go-lucky people, and they all said that they wanted their money back. So, you know, I don't know what Whitney is going through. I just got to send out a little prayer to my girl. All right, speaking of old divas, Jennifer Lopez has been released from her Sony record label. Now, details are kind of sketchy as to why that, you know, she was actually released from the record label, but I think it's because her time is up and she may just need to think about retiring. I mean, <laughs> she had a run and it seems like, you know, she was really known for her booty, not really, you know, her talent. She could dance. She could dance. I'm not going to take that away from her. But Kim Kardashian really took her spot. <laughs> and now I think she just needs to go and live happily ever after with Mark and the twins and just give it up. Now, it's being reported that Young Berg got his behind whooped <laughs> over the weekend at a party. Now, some people are saying that it was by a group of girls. Some people are saying by a group of guys. I really don't know. But he is definitely a good target for an ass whooping because his mouth just does not stop. Anyway, <laughs> we've seen him get punched out by a white guy before. He's got slapped by Mano. I was actually at the club that night. I wish to God it was me. I was about to beat him up earlier that day at the radio station. <laughs> 
and that's on tape somewhere i don't even know where that tape is but let me tell you if i find it it's going to be right here on the most access anyway well um he took to a video camera and basically said that he was in another state at the time and that he did not get beat up whatsoever he thanked his mom for his good looks and whatever whatever i don't know he he didn't look like a victim that time but eventually somebody's going to get him again <laughs> Now I gotta send a big, big shout out to my girl, Monica. She released her video, Everything, this week. And the video was actually hot. Like, it was a, a step out of the whole Monica's world, you know, that she built up for herself with the kids and Rocco. It was a whole new look for Monica. So she really was working it with her uh, Alexander McQueen fashions. Uh, she dedicated it dedicated the video to him at the end so that was a good look also i think the chick in the video was eva mendez that was playing the stalker part i'm not really sure if it was eva or not but she was definitely a close candidate now be on the lookout for monica's album it is going to be dropping next month so i'll give you a definite date next week shout out to michael vick now some people don't like him but in the a he's still going to be king here and uh, he's been offered one million dollars to pose for playgirl magazine now the only catch is he won't be receiving the one million dollars he has to donate it to PETA. so do you think he should do it i don't know but i'm kind of curious to see what michael vick is working with so <laughs> I think he should do it. Anyway, speaking of Michael Vick, he's going to be in the ATL over the weekend at the Velvet Room. So, you know, if you're in the city, make sure you go and check him out. Thank you guys for checking me out. It's your girl, Miss Shinika, with my weekly rant. Now, you got to look for me each and every Friday right here on The Most Access. And I appreciate you guys. Bye-bye. <music>